Hello, I'm going to tell you something about the process we went through when we started working at the Compress Water Bottle. After almost a year, the bottle is finally done. It's as small as most normal water bottles, but can carry up to two and a half liters of water. Once we had the ID, we started working, but we had many technical issues. First, we needed a strong metal that could handle the high pressure and wasn't too expensive. It also needed to be lightweighted, because it needed to be easy to carry with you. Not only in normal situations, but also in heavier conditions, like mountain climbing or other uh, heavy sports. We have luckily found the right material. It was developed by, developed by a group of researchers in South Korea. There's no official name yet, but we got in contact with the researchers and we have made a deal. Currently, we are the only company that's allowed, that's allowed to use this new metal. When the metal pl plates arrived in Holland, we started to make some prototypes. And that wasn't easy. Because a lot of prototypes exploded because of the, the high pressure. So we went back to the drawing table. The problem was that the bottle cap was too weak. So we had the idea to make a cap of the same Korean material. And that worked luckily. So we now make 50 bottles a day. And we are going to expand the production.